So you're thinking about moving to San Diego, but you want to learn more about the different universities in San Diego, whether it's for you or it's for your child. Our goal in this episode is to tell you more about University of San Diego. We started a series recently talking about the top five universities in San Diego where we hit all of them. And now we're going in depth in five separate videos to dive deep into each different university so you can learn more about them and decide which one's gonna be right for you or for your child. I'm Kyle Whistle with Whistle Realty Group, your guide to living in San Diego. I'm one of the rare born and raised San Diegans who've lived here 40 plus years of my life and I wanna share my experience with you so you can decide if living in San Diego is gonna be right for you and for your family. If you enjoy the content today, make sure to hit the thumbs up button, let YouTube know. If you got questions, throw them in the comments section down below. And if you want more of our content, hit the subscribe button, little notification bell, YouTube will take care of the rest. Let's dive in. University of San Diego. Uh, we rank these all based on the uh, student count, so uh, all top five of these. And University of San Diego is another private school. And when we try to get data on private schools, sometimes a little bit tougher to get data. Um, we're gonna give you as much data as we possibly can. All the data we provide is from usnews.com. Link will be down below to that data so you can check that out if you have questions on any of it. Um, so enrollment, you're looking at roughly 9,000 students at University of San Diego. Um, and this school is located in one of the areas I grew up as a kid um, called Bay Park. This is going to be coastal San Diego. Um, the campus even has a view of the ocean, a uh, view of Mission Bay. It's a pretty killer campus. It's gorgeous. Um, this is an older school built in 1949. So a uh, very established school. You're talking, you know, 70 plus years of history, which 70 years is a long time for San Diego. Um, obviously, we were not the first state in the United States. We were uh, much closer to 50 than number one. So um, anything that's that old, that is definitely considered older for San Diego standards. Um, so again, you're located in Bay Park, which is a killer location right by the coast. You can be at the beach in five, 10 minutes. You could be downtown in five or 10 minutes. You could be in Mission Valley, go to a game at Snapdragon Stadium in five or 10 minutes. Like everything is very, very close. So super central location. Um, so, and you can live on campus there. So a lot of the schools uh, do not offer on-campus housing here in San Diego, but 16% uh, of the students that go to USD actually do live on campus. So if you kind of want that campus dorm life, that is something that's going to be available to you at USD. Um, their mascot, they have sports, is a big thing at USD. Um, they have, their mascot is the Torero. Um, they're division one school. So um, they're definitely competing up there at a high level. Kind of funny, their uh, gym where they play basketball and some of them volleyball and some of the other sports. Um, Jenny Craig, who's a, a big uh, philanthropist, I believe is the word. I don't know, hopefully I probably didn't mess that up. Uh, but Jenny Craig actually donated a lot of money to help build the gym. And Jenny Craig is uh, obviously in the weight loss business. So they call it the Slim Gym. Ah, witty, right? Um, so yeah, definitely, you know, check out a game there. Um, good times. So let's get into some of the other numbers. The acceptance rate to USD is 59%. Um, so uh, not everybody's getting in there, right? That's about 60% of kids are getting in there and 40% are not. So uh, you know, not the easiest school in the world to get into. Um, the faculty to staff ratio is one of the lowest of these top five at 12 to one. So you're gonna, like you would expect, right? When you go to a private school, you want a little bit more hands-on, um, smaller class sizes. You're at 12 to one, which is very, very low relative to the public school. So you're definitely going to get what you pay for, but you're gonna pay for what you get. You're talking 53,000 a year uh, for tuition. So this is by far the most expensive of the five on the list, but you're gonna get that hands-on attention that you're likely looking for. Um, graduation rate, we're looking at 69%, which is on the high end. Um, so you're getting a good amount of students that are graduating from the school. Um, some of the things that we like to look at is figure out what are schools rank for? Like, what's that thing, right? Like, what do you, what does a school tend to do better at than other schools out there? And so a couple things that I found interesting when looking at the rankings, um, they were number three nationally, period, straight up number three university in the nation, um, which there's thousands of universities across the nation, number 93. Uh, which is a very high honor to be in the top 100 universities in the nation. That's not for a specific major, that's period. Number 93 in the nation, so shout out to USD. Great job on that. Um, also, they rank number 11 for real estate. Interesting, um, I actually didn't know that. So that was really interesting to find out too, number 11 for um, real estate. And another thing that they, they tend to be known for is uh, 
going to law school. Like we, there's a lot of lawyers coming out of USD. So that's another thing they tend to do really well. Um, we also look at the top five majors. So top five majors you're going to have at USD business management, um, coming in at number one, biology, number two, social, uh, social sciences. Uh, those are tongue twisters, those double S's, uh, number three, engineering. Um, and then you've got communications coming through on there. So top five majors you're going to run into there. Um, and that's really what you got. USD private school, killer campus, um, top hundred in the nation. Um, so check out USD, a very cool campus. One of the fun things, if you're um, coming to San Diego for whether again, you're coming here for yourself to go to school, or you have a child who's going to be coming to school here is, is do campus tours. Um, this is a, a campus. I know you'll have a good time touring. Um, so definitely check it out. You can get one of the biggest burritos in San Diego, a place called JV's right down the hill from USD. So JV's their burrito. It's like, I swear it's this big. I don't know how they expect any one person to eat one of their burritos, but they're delicious. So check them out. Hope you got some value out of the video today. If you did hit the thumbs up button, uh, let YouTube know if you got questions, throw them in the comment section. And if you want more of our content, hit the subscribe button and the little notification bell. And if you're thinking about moving to San Diego, you want to learn a little bit more about the, the different universities in San Diego, the different areas where these universities are located, or just anything in general about what it would be like to live in San Diego, give us a call or shoot us a text at the number down below that will connect you with my team where you can learn a little bit more about you, your goals, and put a plan in place to help you accomplish those goals. I'm Kyle Whistle, Whistle Realty Group, your guide to living in San Diego. Thank you so much for tuning in to this video. We'll see you soon.